Hello everybody, welcome back to the Binding Gods Afterbirth. We're going to do a lost run today because I'm feeling pretty confident from our last green mode excellence uh, run that I'm still incredibly proud of. Uh, we got Tinted Rock right there. But really we're looking for, uh, we're looking to defeat Mega Satan on this run and that, that may be a little bit of a jump ahead here. Like, hey, you beat the easiest game mode in the game with the, one of the hardest characters, now you want to go and fight Mega Satan. And uh, as much as I agree, I also uh, want to argue that I believe we are good enough to fight Mega Satan, uh, get a successful loss victory here, and win the uh, NBA Finals with our current setup. So that's my two cents here. We are going to pop in and grab Small Rock right here, which is a great pickup. Which also makes me not want to go bomb that uh, Tinted Rock if we get a bomb, because I know that it's not going to be Small Rock, and that's about all we want as the Lost saying as we have no HP. Excellent. I hope everybody's having a real good one here. It is a beautiful, gorgeous Wednesday afternoon. Uh, it's 80 degrees outside, finally feeling like summer, uh, and it's just, you know, it's real nice. A lot of people would argue that it's a little bit too hot today. Uh, I, I do agree that 80 is a little bit hot. If you're going to give me warm weather, I, I love the 70s, man. Uh, the 70s in terms of degrees Fahrenheit and 70s in terms of uh, the era in the United States where the music just popped off. There's another uh, damage up there. Not a big one, but one nonetheless. But, uh... There's always that universal argument of which is better, winter or summer. Do you want the hot or do you want the cold? And I'm going to put this to rest here by saying this. So, obviously you've got those people that, uh, you know, old people as a... And this does, is not going to be ageist at all here. Did we just get the uh, greatest item as... No, we need... No, 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 no. don't do that. <laughs> If we had Isaac's heart, then we had a uh, solid victory right there, but we didn't. So therefore, don't don't kill yourself with blood rights. Uh, but you always got the old people that moved down to Florida because just too damn cold in the uh, Ohio and Alaska. We can't handle cold. We got to go down to Florida. And you know what? I'm totally okay with that. Uh, Florida is a nice place to be. It's a good place to retire to. You want to go down to Florida? Uh, you know, you do whatever. Uh, old man Jenkins and his wife, old Lucy Jenkins. Uh, you do you. I'm basically hoping for a key here. Uh, we did not get one. Uh, but, you know, in my opinion, I like it to be hot outside because in the winter you can't really, uh, you know, bring a blanket outside and, you know, have the community look at you in a nice way because then they might think you're homeless and then that raises all kinds of other issues. But, uh, I like it to be hot outside, cold inside. When it's hot inside, then you just, you got that, like, humid, crappy, like, cold sweat you break out into, and then you, you know, forget where you are, you wake up in Vegas, surrounded by, uh, Zach Galifianakis and all of his friends, and you just, it goes downhill really fast. But when it's hot outside, you can cool yourself down with some lemonade, you can, uh, okay, this we will take just on the off chance of a great synergy plus it's going to provide some good damage and i don't really want to d4 this run because this run's looking pretty okay so we will rock tammy's head but uh when it's cold inside you can uh cuddle up with a blanket wear the world's you know your favorite sweatshirt that says number one dad even though you in fact are not actually a dad we're not going to take this we're going for mega satan uh, i wanted to remind everybody of that you know scenario here as good as this item is, it's also not good as the Lost, so I see no reason to take it. But you can uh, come inside, you can make a nice hot cup of hot cocoa, uh, or coffee, depending on what your preference is. I, I myself, am a hot chocolate and tea kind of guy. I don't really rock the whole coffee thing. But you know, a lot of people, coffee is what gets them through the day, and I, I'm totally with you. Uh, there is something to be said for a nice little caffeine burst. It is, you know, the world's most used drug, I'm pretty sure. Uh, and a lot of people are going to be like, oh, caffeine ain't a drug. Tyler, what are you on? Caffeine's a drug, dude. Uh, you're, you're, you're 
missing out on the whole understanding how chemicals work and all that good stuff. Uh, and that that's okay. I'm fine with that. You know what? We'll take the left hand. I think that the opportunity to become guppy is important on this run. Uh, and I should do that room, but it also scares me a little bit, so I'm not going to do that room. I don't know. Should we? No. You know what? I've always been an advocate of not using the left hand. I think it's kind of a piece of crap. It's never going to pay out with guppy items. Oh, it'll pay out with like one over the course of an entire run. But I'd rather get the opportunity to pick up Cricket's head from a golden chest or pick up uh, like Steven from a golden chest, pick up more consumables from a golden chest, like, you know, have money to go to shops, etc., etc., etc. Blank card is a greater opportunity here than Tammy's head. Uh, that didn't work at all how I wanted, but also worked out okay. There's the key that we've been wanting for a long time. Still got an item room to go find. We also got a shop to go find. Having blank card now gives us the opportunity to have synergies like blank card, chaos card that can take down Mega Satan in, you know, one blow. Uh, Tyler, uh, didn't, don't you remember? Chaos card only knocks out the first phase of Mega Satan. You wouldn't actually accomplish your goal. Dude, if you use blank card, chaos card, then use the actual chaos card, you're in for a good time. Uh, oh, okay, I am I misunderstood you. You didn't display it clear enough. I You suck at Isaac. Thank you, YouTube comments. You guys are solid gold most of the time. Uh, but blank card just allows us to accomplish something great in the future. Uh, what that something great is, I don't know yet, but the opportunity for something great to occur is real good. We can also get, you know, a Jera rune and take off. We also now got Diplopia, but we don't have enough money, so I'm not even going to worry about it. And we will just move on to our boss. I'm kind of hoping we get a deal with the Angel right here. I'm sorry if I'm like sounding like I'm fading away from my mic. My back is hurting, so I'm like moving all over the place to try to figure out how to make myself comfy in this chair right now. Explosive Diarrhea is pretty bad. Uh, Balls of Steel is also useless as our current character. Uh, perks should have been used on a different area but this is fine uh and am i dumb enough to walk in here without waiting for that to turn off yes because we're only fighting the hollow uh did i know that ahead of time i uh, no <laughs> i didn't okay uh we'll, we'll be fine though just gotta fight these hopefully we get a deal with the angel here so we can f start getting off on our that that's not the right phrasing at all uh start getting our key pieces set up here we gotta deal with the freaking devil. Uh, that is not at all what we wanted. And then you're gonna give me a bunch of items that I would love to... Actually, I really wouldn't love to pick up any of those. So this is, once again, a pretty easy deal with the devil to ignore here. We can, you know, fight through. Wait for that beautiful deal with the angel to occur. Uh, if we pop Sacred Heart in a deal with the angel, we're gonna be in real freaking good shape. We gotta be careful here, though because one hit and we cannot get out of that room which should be something that i should be a little bit more careful about but i'm also tyler and careful never really uh pops into the vocabulary a whole lot when i'm talking okay we need to find our item room i don't know why i put the weird accent on that one it's because i thought i was gonna get hit there uh will we do this room oh you you bet i'm gonna do this room this is a great opportunity to get uh, pretty much jack all from this. So that's fine. Uh, it just means we got to fight some bosses now. These bosses should not be all that difficult. But they're still bosses nonetheless. I didn't talk a whole lot about picking up Scapegoat in this first uh, item room. But I, for one, a lot of people uh, talk down on Scapegoat of being a bad item in the game. Punching bag, whatever the hell you want to call them. I honestly, I think it's a pretty okay item. Uh, being able to distract an enemy from you makes it kind of uh, a good defensive item and ultimately provides some benefit. So I think that he is totally fine for us to pick up. 
and could be really, really good on some of the later game bosses like Isaac, uh, the Lamb, stuff like that. Okay. Where, where is our item room? It's a new children's book, Where is My Item Room? By Shel Silverstein. His new collection of poems from the other side of the sidewalk. Okay, we will just fight our boss now. It's Carrion Queen. That's not one you see too too often in a uh, old Ida uh, in an old boss room. Our chance at a deal with the devil here is super low. Oh my lord! How did we not die right there? I will totally use 400 bombs here. We should have died so hard right there. Come on. You little screw bag, come on. Keep on fighting punching bag, that's fine. Oh, I do not like this at all, man. This is one of those times where a uh, blank card fool to get out of here and then try it again later would be totally okay by me. That's another thing blank card can do is be a uh, fail safe on a floor where we're on a room where we don't feel safe. We could pop a blank card in any room possible teleport. Okay, we're alive. Oh boy. That one, that one worried me a little bit. Uh, I feel like we dodged death a solid 228 times right there. Uh, not 227, don't be ridiculous, but 228 seems like a pretty good number. Oh boy, uh, yeah, that was a good time. Now we can go find our item room. Uh, have it maybe be a little less stressful than that right there, because I'm pretty sure my you know pulse just increased a lot right there. My heart rate's now up to, you know, a abnormal 190 over 4 million. I'm pretty sure I'd be dead if it was uh, 190 over 4 million. Saying as the norm is 120 over 80. That's anatomy class right there, everybody. I don't know, really know how those guys all blew up, but I'm going to be totally fine with it and move on. Here's our item room, something we've been looking for for 48 years. We're going to pick up Eden's Blessing, uh, which will be great on our next run, but also give us a hefty tears up on this run, uh, which is, you know, I'll be completely honest with you, I think Eden's Blessing is up there on one of the best items in the game. The ability for it to positively impact one run and positively impact your next run uh, is just incredible. Uh, Tyler, I got Eden's Blessing, and it gave me Marked, and then also gave me... Okay, we'll blank card that real quick. Then we grab this. Uh, well, we grab we 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 grab this, and then we just go, and then we'll get up to 99 keys real quick right now. Uh, but Tyler, I, I picked up uh, the stupid Eden's blessing gave me marked on my next run. Plus, it gave me uh, Ipecac my reflection at the same time. And then I lost the run. Okay, uh, you do that. That's fine. I think we literally just, you know, call it a day here. Uh, have our 96 keys and move on with our life. Uh, we will not need keys for the rest of this run. Uh, or, you know, probably next run if the keys copied over, but they don't. We also picked up Chaos. Uh, I know that I didn't say too, too much about that. I figured that was a self-explanatory pickup. Uh, being able to get anything in our rooms now especially to be fair in our deal with the angels because they now become a lot better uh item pool for us because they can have deal with the devil items in there completely free we also got golden bombs for the floor uh which means i will be placing down a fair amount of bombs to do some damage uh and this is looking way up for us right now i was really hoping we'd get some items from this room uh which is why i ultimately did it but we also just got, like, enough consumables to make our shop worthwhile on this floor. Uh, you know, at least two items on our shop. And with Chaos, two items on the shop can be an incredible haul. Uh, I, this, for some reason, deals the devil items love to appear in the shop whenever you're uh, with Chaos. Uh, Tyler, that's because the item pools are all... Yeah, I know, I know, calm down. Man, the comments are just out of control in this video today. But, uh... It just seems like the de Deal with the Devil items more commonly appear in the shop, especially something like Horror Babylon. I always see that in the shop on Chaos Runs. Uh, and that would be something I would highly get behind right now, is a beautiful Horror Babylon pickup. We will see, though. 
uh, we still have to find our shop and actually survive before we uh, can talk about buying stuff from the shop. So how about we survive first? Consumables are slowly becoming a complete non-issue on this run. Uh, we are just getting consumables upon consumables. That was horrible, terrible damage. Uh, and it's a good thing that we have Holy Mantle or else Old Boss, we would have been dead right there. This is another room that can uh, straight up suck my butt because the random uh, you know, flying people at you in limited space is not my fave. Sure, we'll blow this up, get in a little extra Monet. Don't really even want to screw with pills at this point, uh, just because pills can be bad. I know pills with the holy, the lost holy mantle, blah 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 can be okay, but I don't know. I'm not feeling it right now. We're also gonna get really lucky, uh, find all of the stuff that we wanted to find. Uh, Okay, this is the run of just dodging death over and over. Uh, I also knew that a greed fight had to happen here soon. Uh, and I suppose I'd rather have it happen now than in our last possible shop. And you know what? Getting steam sale while we still have uh, one shop to go? One shop to go? Yeah, one shop to go is also totally fine. So I can accept that. That will give us, uh, you know, two items for sure on our next shop, most likely. I also, uh, off-camera, got... The 900 coins in the regular donation machine, which unlocked Blue Candle. I know that you guys have been seeing all of the stuff that I've been unlocking, so I just wanted to explain that I donated on the last run, and that's why uh, we now have Blue Candle in our lineup and one extra achievement for those of you that are tracking that kind of stuff. Uh, can we also talk about how I didn't get hit right there? Because uh, that was pretty incredible. Should be utilizing bombs as much as possible. We got, you know, infinite homing bombs here. And infinite homing bombs requires me to, uh, you know, actually use them in order to get any benefit out of it. Should get our first deal with the uh, angel here, hopefully. If we don't, then this run is just... Put the oh, you've got to be kidding me, game. Stop it. I don't want you. I've, I've not done three of these. We're honestly running out of uh, deal with the angel opportunities. I'm going to be real pissed if this is one of those runs where you just don't get deal with the angels. Uh, and then we're going to have a fully functioning run that just goes to crap. Game, I will be straight up pissed at you. So don't do, don't do that to me today. Okay, explosive diarrhea. Uh, last I checked, not a great pill. Unless we are in desperate need of bombs, but we are not. Still being careless here with the old HP. Uh, Tyler, what HP? You're the lost. Still holy mantle. You know what I'm talking about. Calm down, viewer. Comments are brutal today, I know, but you know, try and calm down a little bit. YouTube comments are one of the most like toxic things ever in the history of anything. <laughs> Luckily, uh, not a lot of people comment on my videos, so, you know, they're not as toxic as they can be, but, you know, maybe one day when I'm rich and famous off of YouTube, people will be commenting on this video, calling me a, you know, cheese ball or something. Okay, here's our shop. I'm real excited for this. You've got to be, uh, pissing cornflakes. Excellent. Uh, this is probably the worst case scenario we could have ever gotten for a shop on our last floor uh does this make me want to love to see oh yeah this is the good stuff right here you've got to be absolutely kidding me seriously you're kidding me right how many uh deals with the devil does it take to get a deal with the angel huh because right now we're sitting at a solid four Having Joker deal with the devil, though, basically ensures that we are going to eventually get golden bombs again. We're not going to eventually get golden bombs again, but we're going to eventually get uh, deals with the angel for sure. At least I hope. It's starting to get a little bit ridiculous. We didn't take a deal with the devil, did we? I'm pretty sure we didn't. If we did, then I'm, I'm really messing up, but I'm fairly certain we didn't. Okay, sad bombs with infinite bombs equals good bombs and good life. 
Okay, we will go fight our boss. We will also have a teleport out of boss rush, which is real nice because we can just, you know, use our blank card Joker right here and succeed. We will also place down as many bombs as we can uh, just to utilize our beautiful bomb synergies here. Uh, and we are dead here. Well, no, not dead, but done with this fight. No need to go check that out. We did take the negative, which is, you know, obviously what we were supposed to do. Uh, none of these are all that great. So we are going to take Halo of Flies for extra protection. And then teleport out. Cry that I can't take those three, because they're all pretty good items. And then move on to the next floor, man. We're doing fine. We just, uh, we're getting screwed over with some various, uh deal with the devil shenanigans right now okay we will pop our joker uh blank card as soon as we get a charge on it so that we can actually you know what we're not going to do it as soon as we get a charge on it we're going to wait and then go back to this room pop it in there uh this this room sucks okay get get rid of those Okay, uh, scared, but we're fine. Excellent. Uh, we also got Blank Card Magician, which is pretty bad. Stay your distance on this room. We're, we're fine. We're in great shape. Okay, uh, we will then go to our mob, mob trap room. That's the word. Uh, and then we will go and pop the joker as soon as we open everything in here okay pop joker it is a deal with the angel it's about damn time we also get contract from below which is real good uh, and then we will get our first key piece here okay that was almost bad that was bad but we got our key piece and we straight out of here okay uh, that worked out well. First key piece down, uh, you know, one to go, but we got three floors of possible deals with uh, whoever to make this work. We died. That was the run, guys. We tried. If you enjoyed, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Screw that room, man. I hate that room. I'll catch you guys next time. Goodbye.